Hi there, welcome back. So today we're going to talk about water pumps. Uh, we've got some of the pumps that we have down here. Um, we stocked the full range of water pumps from 1946 up until 2004. Bentley ones, not the uh, BMW versions, but the, um, the, the V8 ones are pretty much the same housing wise. I'll start off on the six cylinder water pumps. There, there's actually three types um, of six cylinder water pump the Mark VI R type and the S1. Um, the Mark VI one is starts off with the early one. Now, the difference between this and this, as you can see, is this one has a pulley on. I mean, that this one also has a pulley fitted to the flange, but the difference is this one has the pulley put on and then the, the flange is pressed onto the shaft and the pulley is screwed in from behind the shaft. So you can't actually remove the pulley without pulling off the flange. Then they revised it and they have the flange pressed onto the shaft and then the pulley is screwed onto the flange. That's the same for a, a later Mark VI, I think GT onwards, but it, you've always got to check. That's how we dif differentiate between what type of pumps you've got. If you've got the, the removable pulley type or the flange pressed on after the pulley. If you've got an S1, it looks like this. Basically, these are identical beneath the uh, pulley because the housing's the same. We've just got different adapters. As you can see, this Mark VI one, it's got an outlet there. That's for the hose, another hose there, an outlet, that's a threaded part. And then on this one, this got a plug in it. And basically the housing's the same, but the, the different adapters set them apart. All of these bolt on to this, they have a back plate. This back plate's available new as well. And it's usually worth replacing this because uh, it's in the coolant gallery so it's obviously coolant running through it all the time and a lot of rust can you get these just pitted all the way through and rusty um, that then bolts onto an adapter which then bolts onto the block so or the head but the um, these are the gaskets that you'll need to change the water pump the reason why you should go for a new water pump is because we also offer reconditioned ones a lot of the time these rotors are just rusted thin, not much left of them. They can get broken when they're pulling off. Um, the housings can be rusted through. These threaded areas um, all can get corroded away. The seal inside this one is a modern type of seal. On the early ones they have a carbon seal which isn't as efficient. Um, also, when we do a reconditioned pump, we charge a surcharge to get the old one back. So these are available brand new off the shelf with no surcharge. So we've got the, the Mark VI and the R-Type and the S1. They're all pretty much the same. Then moving on to the first of the V8s is with the S2 and S3, or Cloud 2 and Cloud 3 water pump. Um, as you can see, completely different design. This housing is... There's no it bolts straight onto the front uh, timing cover. The upper part of the front timing cover is the water pump housing, and this screws on there with a gasket. We supply the gasket with a bolt and washers. Um, then slightly different version of this, a similar type of pump is, is this, and from the silver shadows all the way through to the, probably even to the modern V8s that are in the production line, the Mulsans and stuff, have this kind of pump with an O-ring the o-ring goes into that water pump housing in the upper timing cover and seals always want to change that o-ring whenever you change the pump and we also do a bolt kit obviously any nuts and bolts around the coolant gallery can get corroded and break and it's always worth replacing the bolts because they're cheap they're, they're, you know that we supply a kit as an uh, automatic upsell when you pull up you can, you can choose not to have it but it's always recommended all these pumps have an original type of seal fitted the same as what Bentley would use and yeah they're three year warranty on the prestige parts ones uh, reconditioned we still offer a two year warranty but you'll get a surcharge and to be honest there isn't much difference in price so like I say we have the full range available um, to see online uh, if you have any questions please feel free to comment below and we'll try and answer them for you um, until next time Thanks for watching.